So today, I'm going to tell you guys a story. This is not no ordinary story. This is an epic story. It is the story of a t in the life of a band kid. So, what happens is the band kid, they have to get up at 5.30 in the morning. So they wake up and they're tired because they have to wake up. And then they get dressed and everything. They go and eat their breakfast because they don't get out for like till 7.45, which is enough time to eat breakfast. Okay, so then they just go to the zero hour, and about this time, someone who isn't in marching band is just now waking up, and they're so excited that they don't have to go to zero hour like those marching band kids. <laughs> Little do they know, marching band kids are awesome. Okay, so after zero hour, she's walking through the halls, where she's going to meet up with a couple of her other band kids who just got done putting their, uh, putting their instruments away and everything. So they're all walking, and because they're kids, you know they're walking in step. <laughs> so they all start walking in step, and then there's that one band kid who refuses to get in step. And they all stare at him. And they continue walking to the classroom, and he gets in step, and the balance is restored. So, once they're in the classroom, being band kids, they can't help resist singing. Then a normal person walks by. What are you guys singing? Our show. What show? The show. Band kids are weird. <laughs> and they hang their heads. But little do they know that weirdness is awesome. So, class is over. And they're heading out to the practice field because they're having a sectional because they're clarinets and they're awesome like that. Well, guys, stop! Who parks their car on the band field? There was a hobble. <laughs> it walks off. So after they do their sectional, they decide to get in their car. And they all are driving down the road when a police officer comes in. Excuse me, miss, but do you know how fast you were going? No. About 20 beats over tempo. I need you to slow it down. Yes, ma'am. This is your only warning. So, getting off of the warning, they start driving down the road when all of a sudden they hit a bomb. Oh guys, I think we ran into some trouble. We ran over something sharp and got our tires flat. Do we need to get any of that? And that is the story of the ride.